If you're looking for an event to get out of the house and hang out downtown, the bridge event is might be for you. Yeah, the family friendly event in partnership with a glimpse of Africa will feature vendors, have musical guests and so much more. And joining us to tell us all about it is founder and CEO of Glimpse of Africa is Frida Canini. Good morning. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good morning. Well, maybe first by tell us a little bit about what is Glimpse of uh, Africa. Yes, Glimpse of Africa is an organization that has just been recently founded and we showcase the beauty of African culture and we are very excited to have been able to bring it to everybody here in town in West Michigan last year. So it was our first festival last year that we were able to bring fashion from Africa. Different countries were represented and um, different things that we were able to show including music, dances, and um, different foods from different countries of Africa. And so what that's what we do. But besides that, we also do uh, culture, um, community engagement. And what did you hear from people last year who attended this event? Um, you know, what did you hear from them about what they liked about it, what they learned, why it was so important for them to be there? Everybody loved everything, especially the fashion was the highlight. People really loved the different cultural dresses from different countries because they were all really different and beautiful and as it is africa is very very diverse so all the countries that were represented were unique and beautiful in the way their dresses looked like so that's one of the highlights and then the food was one other highlight of uh, the event last year but overall everybody liked everything the music uh, the merchandise vendors brought a lot of um, different uh, things from uh, africa like you know the baskets the uh, fabric and uh, so many other things that were there, the jewelry and um, different things that really were in the market. So the marketplace was also very beautiful. Frida, have you had to, obviously things are much different than last year. Have you had to make some adjustments because of the pandemic that we're under and that kind of thing? Yes, a very, very huge uh, adjustment for sure. In fact, as it is, we canceled our festival. It was supposed to happen August 15th. And we also canceled our kickoff of the festival in April. So uh, we were not able to actually do our big festival this year because of COVID-19, but we were able to collaborate with the city uh, on the bridge series of events that are bringing our city back alive after COVID and also just um, sharing our cultural um, effect to the community. So it is different for sure. So real quick, just give uh, give people the details and um, when and where again. Yes, we'll be at Rosa Park tomorrow from uh, noon to 8 p.m. And uh, we are going to have some music and that I have two DJs here with me that will be playing music. They can maybe tell you a little bit about that, but then we'll also be having dancers and uh, somebody doing drums, some food and some merchandise vendors. Very good. Well, Frida, thank you very much. We're out of time. Good luck with the event tomorrow. We appreciate you being with us this morning.